It's been vandalized several times in the past week, apparently by the same person. KTVU's Amanda Quintana is in San Francisco at that mosque with the details. Amanda? Yes, so we are on Sutter Street where this mosque is, and you can see the windows are still broken outside. Uh, this is all while the Muslim community has been participating in Ramadan, that this vandalism happened at least twice in the past week. So today they are celebrating the end of the holy month of Ramadan. There are a lot of people that will be going to celebrations here downtown. Now, surveillance video on social media shows this man smashing windows of the mosque with a skateboard. This happened on April 3rd. The same man reportedly came back yesterday. He broke more windows and then he went into the mosque yelling Islamophobic rhetoric. He allegedly got into an altercation with some, someone and then threatened people and wrote, you will burn in hell on the walls. Now we have a photo showing the words after mosque leaders tried to paint over it. Members of the Muslim community here say in this polarizing time, they want more protection. People think that Islamophobia doesn't exist, but in reality, it happens every single day. A lot of uh, a lot of incidents being unreported, and the truth is that police have other issues to worry about, and we're really asking for them uh, and the city to prioritize the community and make sure that there's more resources and the community is protected. Hala Hajazi, a commissioner with the city's Human Rights Commission, who initially tweeted about these attacks, says the rise of Islamophobic rhetoric, including from public officials, is contributing to violence like this. Now, today, there are many celebrations in San Francisco and all over the world celebrating Eid, the end of Ramadan, and speaking with people, it sounds like some people are scared because of these incidents. They are scared, uh, they're fearful, but others feel it is important to still celebrate and to come together as a community in this important holy time for the Muslim community. Live in San Francisco, Amanda Quintana, KTVU, Fox 2 News.